So right now I'm starting off by sectioning my hair into four sections and then I'm going to spray this leave-in conditioner into my hair. I like to use whatever liquid I have on hand at the moment and this one just so happened to be it. And then I take a little bit of my herbal oil and place it all over the section. I then take my curling gel souffle by Shea Moisture and I place a little bit of that all over the section as well. Now I'm going to start sectioning off a little piece of hair to braid it with. I try not to make this section too small or too large, I like it right in the middle. And then I start using this conditioning butter from Butters and Bars, but I wouldn't recommend using their site because one time I ordered and it took two months for me to receive my shipment and they were not responding to any of my emails, so I refused to buy from them ever again. And now I'm just doing a regular braid. I try to braid a little bit tight because I want the curl to be extremely defined. add a little bit more butter to the end and twirl it just so that I can have really defined ends. Okay, so once again, I just do a regular braid down and then I add a little bit of butter to the end just to make sure that my ends are nice and curly when I take them down.
ladies this is how i wear my hair whenever i do a braid out during the morning time this is how i decide to wear my hair i just wear it up in a little ponytail with a hat on or normally i put a hair wrap on normally whenever i do a braid out i do it overnight so that way it dries and i can wear the hairstyle in the morning time but i did get a really late start last night and i decided to do my braid out this morning so i just threw a hat on and i threw it in a ponytail and then i'm gonna take it down tomorrow and i'll show you the rest in this next clip So it is the next day and this is how the braids look. I'm just going to put them in two different sections just to get the braided hair all out of the way so that I can start taking on the braids and I always start in the back. And just in case you're wondering, no, I don't have any oil or butter on my hand. It all depends on how I feel that day and this day I did not feel like putting any oil or extra butter inside of my hair. So this is how this section of my hair looks right after I've taken the braids out. As you can see, it is very defined. I can't wait for you guys to see the next section. And here is the next section. As you can see, my hair is nice and defined. It is very fluffy. It is very bouncy. Work it, girl. Yes. So this is my hair after I have taken my braids out. It is very fluffy. My hair is still very soft. It's not greasy. It is not oily. It is the perfect braid out. And in case you're wondering, I do not do any extra fluffing to my hair. This is just how my hair looks as soon as I have taken the braids out. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, that wasn't good.